Hello everyone, my name is Devashish and I welcome you all to this Friday video tutorial series. So in this video series, I'll be uh, I'll be explaining to you how can you use Frida to automate your reverse en reverse engineering efforts. So this is the official uh, website of Frida. Uh, as you can see, it says Frida Dynamic uh, Instrumentation Toolkit for Developers, Reverse Engineers, and Security Researchers. So there will be high level overview of uh, you know what is it and how can you install it. Uh, it's scriptable, portable, free and here is how you install frida on your system so there are a lot of documentation available as well uh, and tutorials and so let's get started uh, so we'll start with uh, installation of frida on your windows system uh, since this is the very first video uh, so before you you know attempt to install frida on your system make sure you have python 3 and above installed on your on your windows os uh, so we are in the path so what you have to do here Mm, I already have uh, Frida installed on the system, I believe. So you can use pip install Frida tools. So this should fetch Frida from internet and you know get you uh, get it uh, installed on your system. So this is since I already have it uh, installed, so it's not going to do it. Uh, so one more thing you have to verify once you install it. You can go to just simply Python shell and import frida so if it is successful which means uh, the installation was successful uh, now you have to i mean make sure a couple of things so the frida will be installed here uh, under python lib site packages as you can see frida core and these are the frida tools that are available and there are few uh, few pre-compiled tools that get shipped with frida which you should be able to find in script uh, scripts directory as you can see is frida frida discover frida ps frida trace frida kill etc etc so this is the default path where those you know pre-compiled binaries will be placed uh, so in the in, in the next few videos we'll see how can you you know utilize this uh, pre-compiled tools and how it can help you uh, automate a lot of your reverse engineering efforts so since this is the very first video and we just we have just seen how can we uh, you know get started with frida Mm, so so this is this is a very short video uh, so i hope uh, you find it useful and i'll see you in the next video thank you